Hello everyone, welcome back to a new episode of Summer in Mara. I went ahead and just took the opportunity to go ahead and cut down a bunch of trees. Because I remembered last time that we needed a bunch of boards for the uh, pier to repair it. So I do believe that's enough now. I mean, let me just verify. We might need to get like maybe one more log. Uh, no. Okay, we yeah we need we need one more piece of wood, so we can go ahead and over here and just chop down this tree. But I got most of it because it needed eight boards, which was quite a few trees. So I didn't want to make everybody sit through that basically. So all right, Oop, not tools. Workshop board. There we go. Now we should be able to repair the pier, which I assume we have to repair before we can actually leave on the boat. Like they didn't tell us that, but. I would assume that's probably the case, because I kind of went up to the boat and nothing happened. So, alright, I guess we're gonna do like Napopo said, get out here and sail, navigate. Sleep in the boat, interesting, speed up, okay, cool, so here we go, here's our boat. I don't know who's working those oars. Must be... Uh... Goa? We also do have the fuel to worry about. But where are we supposed to go, so... Uh... I can sleep in the boat, but I don't know why I would. Alright, I guess we'll just explore. I, I don't believe they gave us a direction to go. Uh, for some reason, north is in my head. So I'm just going to kind of go to the north and see if that's where we're supposed to go. Yeah, there's home island. I wonder how spaced out the islands and things are in the game. Or if there's, you know, like fast travel or something. Or am I going to have to kind of actually have a travel time to each destination every single time? What's happening here? We hit a loading screen. Um, why does it say north? West and East are locked. Oh, cool. You've discovered a new place in Mara. Yeah, and that's where we're supposed to go, too. Can I talk to you guys? <laughs> Don't seem up. Not Popo, you have a very good sense of direction. <laughs> could you guide me forever? <laughs> You're the best. Now, maybe we could ask those yayas over there. Uh, what ones? Do you mean on the boat? Or I'm guessing you think I docked. Yeah, yeah, okay. You, you, you think I docked. I did not dock. So, how do I exit the boat? Oh yeah, it was B. Alright, here we are in our first town. What are... Excuse me, is that a garbage can that looks like a frog? Oh, there's a lot of stuff going on here. Ooh. Yoink. Free stuff. Bottles? I don't know why I would want those. Excuse me, why do you have a bottle? Look, Ganon and Luna Bella, you made it in the game. Meow. My perfect kitties. Love mommy blush wolf. The crab mail service carries messages from all over the world, some written in languages that nobody from Mara knows. Huh, is that is that Kickstarter backer stuff? Or is that like, will I get the ability to leave a message on a crab and someone will find it in their game? Because that one was pretty adorable. Somebody just left a message for their cat. Good on you, Blush Wolf. Maybe I'll leave a message for my cats, if that is indeed how this works. Alright, so let's talk to these yayas, as Koa put it. Ah. Uh. Hello. How about you? <laughs> wow, you are yayas. Uh -huh. What are you talking about, kid? I am Noho, and this is Caleb. We know no Yaya. <laughs> yes, you are. You're like my grandma. Your grandma is a Quido, but <laughs> my grandma is Yaya Haku. I know no Quido. We are Quido. Mm. Am I Quido? Um, that's a good question. You see, some years ago I met a teen girl like you. She was young and strong. She liked to swim very much. She swam through two seas. Mm -hmm. It was further than the storm belt, of course, where the sea is no longer called Mara. The thing is, the two seas are connected by a great coral reef. It was said that squid quidos live there. 
Half Guido, half squid. They didn't have legs, only tentacles. <sighs> Are you lost? A bit. This is Qualus, right? Qualus? I'm gonna go with Qualus. I'm looking for a woman, Samey. I think she lives in the lighthouse. Oh. The tide started the rise and the undertow was terrible. The girl couldn't get out of the water. Then she noticed something was dragging her foot. <laughs> yes, she's the lady of the lighthouse. Oh. At last she made it to the shore. Barely made it. But she had tentacle marks all over her leg. Oh. And the sea was calm. So if you were born here on Ku, you are Guido. Although you don't look like one. That's good to know. Thank you. I'll head to the lighthouse and ask. Go to the lighthouse and search for Sammy. Okay, so he was telling us a story and this guy was just like totally sandbagging his story. I never heard anything good about the shop. Rude. It's closed. Only opens between 10 and 16. Okay, so yeah, we got here too late. Hmm, what is this? Anything? It seems like we can just kind of pick up items anywhere. And it's... We can kind of explore anywhere as well. Okay, that doesn't seem like an area we can go to, actually. Can I not jump out of the water here? I guess I'm gonna have to swim over here to the beach and just kind of climb up. I hope I don't get stuck on this guy's hook. Nope. That was a big fish. Oh, it reset me back to my boat. Okay. Weird. Okay, so a lighthouse, but also there's a bunch of things here I want to explore. It doesn't seem like there's much reason to explore a lot of it, but... Hey girl, do I have something on my face or what? Wow, you're cool. Do you like my King of the Pirates costume? <gasps> it's Luffy! Luffy! What are you doing, Luffy? I mean, it doesn't look like his shirt at all. But, uh, your hat's good. Yeah, I do love your King of the Pirates costume. I'm pretty big into One Piece. Not like massively into it, but I've watched a good 600-700 episodes of it. So that little reference is appreciated. My mom says that this is a waste of time and money. Mm. I don't have enough money. Um. I don't have enough money. <laughs> is that just a, uh, yeah, that's the uh, little, yeah, the ball things that you get toys in. The roaring of engines as boats leave the port. It relaxes me. Hello? I look divine in this light. To the right. No, to my right. I can't believe she ditched me. Okay. Interesting. I kind of want to explore the beach. Let's do some more of that. Maybe we'll find more crabs with messages. Or just get some free items? I like how this beach ball is just unmovable. If a wave destroys my castle, I'll get very angry. Is it just the two of us for the picnic? I should organize better birthday parties. Hmm. Hi, I'm Koa. Maybe you can help me with something. Oh. Uh, we're... H Hello, I'm Bram, yeah. Are you okay? No. Oh. It's just... I think I messed up. With what? My uncle is opening his establishment soon, and we need supplies. So I ordered some corn at the market, but, uh... They only brought me corn seeds. It's a disaster. The corn comes from the corn seeds, so I don't see a problem here. Well, I don't have any place to plant them. If you give them to me, I'll bring you the corn. For... for real? Of course. That would be awesome. My uncle Taka is nice, but he's also strict. I don't know how he would react. Thank you very much, brr. You're welcome, brr. <laughs> Alright, so plant corn seeds and give him the corn. So we'll do that once we go back to... Home Island. Excuse me? Oh, I thought that was graffiti. Are you an octoling? Or not an octoling, but a squidling? I think that's, that's what you look like. I have to see a big wave, even though I can't surf. Well, look at that. We have inklings. Oh, wait, is it inklings? Squidlings? I know Octoling is definitely one of them. I haven't played Splatoon in a bit. I never know what he's talking about, but he's so handsome. I can hear the sound of the sea from here. Hello. Um. I hope that one day I'll reminisce and remember this game as being one of the best experiences of my life. 
I grew up loving a few games and I haven't felt that same feeling in a while. I have big hopes. XV2. Yeah, so these are... These definitely seem to be like messages you can leave to other people. Whether... I don't, I don't think it's Kickstarter messages because I don't even know if this game was Kickstarted really. It might just be something you can do in-game. So that's how you open a bank account. Hey, did you see how beautiful the sky is? Oh, there's a lot of people on this beach. Oopsie, I'll mind my own business and ignore the old woman staring at me. I wish my grandchild was so smart. What an architectural ingenuity. She needs to rest and get her energy back. Oh, okay. We just rested on the boat, right? Wait, where did... Where did it take me? I mean, maybe we should just eat some stuff to get our energy back. Let's see. We got in the inventory here. We have a ton of carrots. I also have candy? I don't think we need to do any more of that, though. Alright, let's 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 get back down here to the beach. I was having a good time exploring this. And we even managed to pick up a little side quest down here, so... Who knows when there will be more side quests. I do agree with that person, though. I hope this is an experience like Stardew Valley for me, where I can... Always just reminisce at the good times and everything. And that's honestly why I love LPing as much as I do. Because it's like, it's not just for other people, it's for me too. Because I can come back and watch these videos at any time and kind of reminisce on some of my favorite adventures. And it's, I don't know, it's nice. It's a nice thing for me to think about. Like, what if I'm old and can't play games at some point or I lose the ability to play games? I could just come back and watch all of my old playthroughs. What am I going to do without a job? I'd rather take pictures from here than walk all the way up to the lighthouse. Fair. This is a massive, massive town. Oh, lucky Neko! Hey, kitty. You're not doing- you're not waving your arm, though. Uh, are you good, sheep? I don't know if you are. Whoa, I can just steal these? Yoink! <laughs> I just stole those people's cabbages. What the hell? I didn't think that was actually going to be possible. But sure enough. Okay. I mean, it seems like we can pick up some different things around here, but... I'm kind of just going to run around and look for these arrows, probably, mostly. Because most other things just seem like little side content things that I can do. So let's focus on some of these. Hello, what are you? Oh, I can sleep. Hmm. Maybe I should go sleep in my boat. Because it gives you the option to sleep in the boat, and I think that refills your energy too, without having to, like, eat all your food. So, let's see if it'll let me. Sleep in boat. Yes, I do want to spend the night in the boat. Refill my energy, please. Leave the boat. Eh, it set me back to half. So, not horrible, but oh! Wait, you open at what, 10? Um... 10 and 16. Well, I, I guess shops shouldn't really be that big of a deal to me, since I don't have money. I'm a poor child running around in the city with no shoes and a hoe. Alright, well... Let's look around. I believe you're the character that's... Yeah, I think you're the character that's, like, on the main screen. Um. There's no time to waste! Oh, maybe not. I think you're just another cat folk. <laughs> Kid, buy something or go away. Wow. Rude. Now I will proceed to not buy something. <laughs> Buy something or go away. What a jerk! I can just commerce with you. I have to eat healthier. Come on, I can do it. Yeah, I think that's the lighthouse down there, so I think we should prioritize getting over there now that I've kind of done a little exploration. I would like to steal some more cabbages from somebody's backyard. Ooh, a park! I want to swing. Yeah. Oh. Uh. Gonna take a ride on the swing. When's my turn? 
Park is very quiet. I don't like it. Why not? What's wrong with something being quiet? Unless it's like creepy, ominous quiet. I love this shirt. It's so cool. Alrighty. Are those apples? I believe they are. Oop. Yoink. Just getting so much free stuff off the ground. Alright, so yeah, this should be the lighthouse. Ooh, that's bees. Okay, I don't want to go over there. I was going to, but never mind. Ooh, ore to mine. Seems like there's just kind of resources hidden all over the place here. I wonder if I can take these apples back and actually plant apple trees on my island? Because I wouldn't mind having a cool little orchard that has, you know, all kinds of stuff in it. What is that down here? Oh, just blackberries. So this is another place to come and get ore if I ever need to. Oh, I need to eat now though, because I wasted so much of that. Okay, so we don't want to eat those. Let's eat the blackberry. And the candy. There we go. Too bad we can't uh, get Koa some chocolate. She always seems to be on and on and on about chocolate, so it would be pretty cool to give her some. Take? Whoa. Oh, that actually worked. Wait, what did I just get? Excuse me? Larva. Weird. I wasn't expecting to actually get that. I also thought the bees would attack me. Mm. I need a better hammer. Oh, that's like silver or something. Okay. Whoa, what's with the giant creepy hand over there? Okay, okay, no, no, no. Stop getting distracted by everything. <laughs> Let's go. Hey, hey. Is Sammy here? Who are you? I want to talk to Sammy. Where are your manners? <laughs> Don't bother me if it's nothing important. Well, looks like it's not going to work. What if I ask the Quidos at the harbor? Hmm. Well, I mean, you could have, like, mentioned your mom? Or your Yaya, as it were. I feel like if you would have mentioned her, maybe she would have been like, Oh, do you know her? Okay, we can talk. But if you don't want to mention her, that's, that's fine. I guess. Let's grab this. What's that? Oh, I just... Wait, is that a queen bee? Does that mean I can get hives back at my place? Yes, it is! The other bees will approach her to make honeycombs. Yeah, I got a queen bee now. So I might be able to make a beehive back on my island. That's so cool. Ah, it feels so good to be playing another life sim game. I wish I was LPing when Stardew Valley came out, because I totally would have LPed that as well. It's usually not the best LP material, but there's just... I don't know, man. There's something I love about it. Alright, what's up? Hello again. Hey, the lady doesn't want to talk to me. That's because you can't go around with manners like those. I once met a man who was a butler. He lived in a huge house. He took good care of his master. It's not that I agree with those kinds of things, but he found a yum yum in the dining room of the house. Thing is, he didn't scream and he didn't become unsettled. He just dealt with the situation. Do you know how? No. Me neither. That's his secret. He didn't want to tell me. So what do I do? Go and ask, kid. Okay. Hey, do you know anything about a lady called Sammy? I'm sorry. We are merchants. If you don't give us something in exchange, our mouths are yeah. sealed. Well, not completely. Oh. That's true. Because I once met a couple along the shores of Oristea that... Okay, I get it. Look, I need some thread. Take some cotton seeds. I'll tell you how to obtain it after you harvest it. Bring me thread and we'll be able to tell you something else. Thread, make some thread at your workshop, and bring it to NoHo. Okay, so that's probably two things we can go back home and do now. Because we have corn seeds to plant, and now we have cotton seeds to plant to get a uh, thread. Alright, cool. So we've got our first uh, couple of little tasks, which is nice. The open sea. So we should just go back to get uh, home. Yeah. Just complete opposite way we came. And yeah, there's... Oh, that's what the that's what the locked like things means. It means those are the only locations you can actually go to right now. 
Or those just don't lead anywhere. One or the other. Whoa, it says just press right to go back to Qualys? That's super cool. If that's a feature, like I can just like fast travel back over there. I like that. Okay, now we run into the problem though of... I already have carrots planted. Also, I didn't water these this morning. The well is run dry, it needs rainwater. Oh no, we have to worry about that? Huh. Do I want to build multiple wells? For that reason? Um, I need a better hammer. Um, I need a better hoe. Okay, so... This is all the tilled land we have for now, it seems. Hmm. Maybe I should just make a better farm somewhere else. I'd be kind of wasting this area at the front, though, but I can't plant those seeds yet because we have to wait for those to grow, which apparently take one more day. Hmm. And I don't guess I just have enough cotton already to do the thing that I need to do. Grilled fish, kitchen workshop, tools. Yeah, no, I don't have any cotton. Hmm. Alright. Well, now that I know the well actually needs to be filled up with rainwater, it seems like making two of those would be potentially a good idea. So maybe we should do that. Hello. I got nails from that? Crow's exhausted. She needs to rest and get her energy back. Uh, okay, let's just eat something really quick so we can sprint back up there. Oop, I didn't mean to eat the apple, but oh well. Should probably plant some of those, like I said. Oh yeah, let's talk to Napopo really quick. Hey, what up? What's wrong? Are you hungry? Oh, it's that? I guess I can make you some juice or something. It's really healthy. Have you ever tried juice? It's really good. I used to hate it, but now I love it. Okay, so we got a new quest for that, too. Alright, so the quests aren't too crazy, and you get them pretty quickly. I was kind of intimidated when I saw that this game had, like, a billion quests, basically. But, uh, yeah, it doesn't really seem that bad. Unfortunately, I don't have any blackberries, so... Yeah... You're probably not going to be getting that juice tonight. Sorry about it. But I promise, I'll get on it eventually. Aha, rain! Oh wait, no, I don't- I don't even need to water now. Damn it. Okay. Well, there we go. So I can harvest these now. And then I can plant some new stuff there. When I plant some stuff, is it automatically going to get watered because it's raining, or does it just trigger the watering the plants at the beginning of the day? I mean, that would be really weird if that was the case. Alright, two corn. And two cotton, I believe. Of course, he gave me three, so I might need three full harvests of cotton. I don't think I have anywhere else I can plant it, though. I mean, I guess I could till some extra land, but... Mm. Can I clean it? Yeah, no, I need a better hoe for that. Yeah, all these are just filled up. Alright, well, we'll... Let that stuff sit there like that for now. There's no new blackberries or anything, right? Let's kind of take a trip around the island. Ooh, there's one. How many do I need again? Okay, yeah, no, we totally have enough to make uh, Napopo some juice. Let's grab some oranges, too, while we're at it. Are the mushrooms something I need to... Ooh, they are. Okay. Let's collect those mushrooms. Let's hit the tree and get these seeds, too. Ooh, that's a different type of mushroom. Okay, I'm getting all kinds now. I wonder what makes the mushrooms grow. I should probably plant some of these, um... Trees as well. I don't want to consolidate all of my trees to one area, but I do kind of want to have an orchard area where most of my trees are, so it's just easier to kind of grind up wood. And I think for the most part, my trees are probably going to be consolidated over there by the house. 
Okay, yeah, these mushrooms are new. Never seen those before. So yeah, right here is where I think I want to plant most of my trees. Okay, so ho. Oh, and we are gonna plant pine nuts. There we go. And let's put another one right here. And let's see. Here's where all of our orange trees are. So, yeah, how about we go ahead and plant an apple tree over here. Let's see, right there seems like a good spot. And then we can put another one right here. Beautiful. Now we have apples growing. Well, not yet, but they'll, they'll, they'll get there. All right, so we also got a worm, so I can do some fishing, I guess. Let's do some fishing. Why not? It's been a bit since we've done this. Uh, no, 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 no. Okay, there we go. Cool. We taught a we caught a uh, taught we caught a uh, red tail catfish. There's more mushrooms. Getting all kinds. I think I've gotten like red, brown, and purple, which I imagine the purple ones are probably poisonous. That's usually how this goes. And there we go. Blackberry juice. Alright, Nopopo. I have something for you. Hope you enjoy it. I worked very, very hard on it. There's also another mushroom back there, so I should probably grab that. It's good, right? Yeah, she liked it. And really fresh, by the way. Yaya always made it for me. Do you have a Yaya? Oh, shoot. I'm sorry. Don't worry. I'll help you with anything you need. Here we go. So there's a little quest complete. Need anything else? Nope, you're just happy now. Uh, oh, you weren't purple, you were like brown mushrooms. Okay, we might be going back to the town soon. Ooh, there's a barrel over there I can break. I think I actually broke this barrel in the prologue and it gave me something. There's also a shell over there. I'm not really sure what the point of the shells is yet. But we might as well collect them anyway. Also, this barrel could have something good in it. What is that? Manure? Fertilizer? Might be. As soon as I get back over here, I'll check. Uh, fertilizer. Yep, that's exactly what it is. Hastens the growth of crops. Alright, just gonna do one quick cursory glance around the rest of the island over here to make sure there's nothing else. What fish can we catch here? Ooh, octopus. So this is where I caught the uh, octopus. Oh geez, you're fast, you're fast. Okay. I played Stardew Valley, I know what this is about. I don't think my fishing rod is good enough for this. Ooh, and I lose thread when I do that. Makes sense. Okay, so that's, that's rough. We gotta watch doing that. But oh well, I feel like we've had a pretty productive day. It seems like these barrels just kind of will wash up on the island occasionally and usually have some stuff in them. Oh cool, more cotton seeds. Not that I need them right now, but it's still appreciated nonetheless. Alright, so uh, should we go ahead and end things off here? Hmm, no. I'm not really sure, I started my timer kind of late, so I'm not exactly sure how long this episode is right now, and for a game like this, I definitely want to make sure I get at least 30 minute episodes. Oh. Oh. No, I didn't want to do that. I didn't know that's what that was. Whoops. I just wasted that. I was like, wait, what is this? I thought it was like an, a resource that was generating, but no, that's just where manure goes. Whoops. I just wasted that. I could have hastened all of these, but I had no idea what it was. Well, damn, that sucks. <laughs> That was, that was my bad. And I just kind of pressed B because I'm like, what is this? Get rid of it. I thought maybe I could save it if I just put it away. But it seems like no. Once you get, once you grab it, it just consumes it. Okay, yeah, we need to rest. Sleep. And then I think we're going to go back to town. That sounds pretty good to me. We got to water our plants here, though. 
big, big shame that I wasted that manure. But what can you do? Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and go back to town. Let's see if it allows me to fast travel back there. Do you want to order a trailer to call us? Coins zero. Except... It doesn't cost anything? Huh. It doesn't cost anything. I guess because maybe this is like one of the main towns, if not the main town. So you don't really have to pay to come back here. Alright, well, <clears throat> let's go ahead and take this opportunity to explore some more of the town. We may potentially get some more quests, and we have to kind of wait until our crops grow anyway. So what better time to get a little bit of exploring done? This game is very pretty. I like it quite a bit as far as uh, aesthetics go. I can't jump on people's houses. I'm not that much of a delinquent, I guess. I'm broke, but what if I sold this house to that lady? I can't miss the musical performance tomorrow. This lady, I always think of Isabel when I see her from the back like that. I have enough money. Oh, look at these little pop stars. Oh, cool, there's a an arrow over here. Okay, what is this location? Kid, get out. You're scaring the customers. Oh, okay. Sorry. I didn't mean to, sir. What a jerk. I mean, I guess I kind of did just barge into his place, though, but still. Oh, it's a puppy. Wait, a dog wants to eat apples? In what world? Weird. Little pond. Hey, I shouldn't fall asleep here, but this is so comfy. Alright, is this kind of like a little area I can explore and do different things at? All uh, my time at Porsche? I don't suppose I can cut these trees down. Yeah, no, it doesn't seem very interested in doing that. I can gather things, though. Fish for eels? Uh, okay, you're... Oh, wait, no, you're just a big catfish. Okay, never mind. It, it, I saw it. I saw it immediately thought of an eel, but no, that is definitely a catfish. A blue squirrel. My little buddy. Oh, you're like a fish squirrel? Weird, why are you... Why are you chasing me? What's your... What's your problem? What... What do you want? Go away. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. Okay, it's... It's left me alone now. Wait, I just stole somebody's food? Oh well. I mean, uh... I, I like to think of it as, uh... An lp -er I watch by the name of H.C. Bailey calls it in RPGs... The hero tax, which is the idea that in any RPG you can just walk into people's house and steal anything. I mean, this game seems like it has like a big bad or something that Koa may be, you know, fighting against at some point. So, yeah, maybe it makes sense. What are you doing here? Hmm. Get? Oh, that's just how we refuel the tank. So that's the guardians here, I guess. Yeah, I did see another beach down here. Seems like there's trash and stuff. I'm not sure what picking up the trash does, but I want to do it. Because littering is bad. Maybe I can, like, take it somewhere at some point and kind of turn it in, too. I've stolen myself from the world, and I'm waiting for sweet eternity. Interesting. Stolen myself from the world, and I'm waiting for sweet eternity. Not sure what they mean by that. The other ones were much more explicit. Alright, so... Whoop, more ore. Might as well grab that, I suppose. Yeah, I like the little jingles that they have playing in this game, too. It's fun. Alright, so what do we have up here? This looks like a big mansion or something. Yes, hello. Uh, there's not much in this big zone right here, but hopefully the mansion has something cool. If I can even get in. No solicitors, no intruders. That's rude. Well, I mean, Koa, I really shouldn't just waltz into people's houses regardless of how 
video games make that very normal. If someone just waltzed into my house and started going through my drawers and stuff and looking in all my rooms for treasure chests, I would be very angry. So I wouldn't want anybody to do that to me. So we shouldn't do it to others. Although me stealing that person's pot of stew that they had cooking was perfectly fine. Okay, it seems like this is kind of it. Yeah, it's not a very big island and it seems like we've explored most of it now. Yeah, and there's nothing up there, and this is, yeah, this is, this just leads back to the lighthouse, which we can't do anything with right now, so. Ooh, there's another beach down here, though. All kinds of crazy ore that I imagine I can't do anything with down here as well. All this trash, maybe I can, like, recycle it at some point? That's a new type of shell. It's like a conch. New fish. Might as well get the new fish. You're easier than the octopus. The octopus was like... I'll call a walleye. The octopus was just like, I, I don't think I... I straight up don't think I can catch that. Uh, it was just way, way too hard. Alright, but this is probably going to be a bit of a long episode, but... I don't particularly mind making these a little bit longer, so... I think we're going to go ahead and end things off here, and I'll see you next time. And I'm not... I might fast forward a bit, maybe grind up some resources on a couple of days, just so our crops will be finished. And uh, that might be how I handle that, or I might just come back and explain exactly what I'm going to be doing, and then I'll just, like, cut as need be. But, uh, yeah, I think we're gonna go ahead and end things off here. I hope you've enjoyed this episode of Summer and Mara, and do not pay attention to the fact that Koa is about to pass out. So, I hope you've enjoyed, and I will see you next time.